Hey guys, I'm super excited. I finally ordered hair dye, so hopefully soon I won't have this weird, like, washed out blonde thing going on on the bottom. But anyways, I am doing a video today. I don't want to show the top of the box because it has my address on it. Um, this company is a subscription box that contacted me and asked if I would like to do a review, so I said sure. This is called Choi, I believe is how it's pronounced. That's what the box looks like, and the top has my address label on it, so I won't show that part. But, I figured I would do like an unboxing, since I've never had this box before, and kind of share it with you guys. So what this is, is a, a box where you can get samples of like super high-end brands, like they have Guerlain and, um, <laughs> of course everything is escaping me now that they have on their website. Um, let me just see, what did I get? They have the, the Clé, de, Clé de Peau, I believe is the name of that brand. Uh, they have NARS, Guerlain, like I said, they have Burberry, um, and they have Benefit and stuff, too. So, I will have all their information to their, uh, website below. So, the first thing here is just a little card saying thank you, and their little logos and stuff that's super cute and there is a little um like an empty eyeshadow pan with a magnet in there which I'm assuming is for the eyeshadow that I asked for a sample of and then it says Choi on the bottom and then this little packet that they send these with all the boxes depending on what you asked for like if you Oops. If you ask for a mascara sample, they will send you a little um, spoolie brush, but it looks like I got a little brush, two doe foot applicators, and an eyeshadow sponge, and then a little blush brush. So that is cute, handy, definitely the little uh, lip gloss ones will come in handy because I believe I don't even remember what I asked for, but um, this is what their box comes in. It has this little sleeve, and then it says Choi again on the actual box itself. And on the inside, it will tell you, in case you forgot what you asked for, it'll tell you the samples that you got. And then it has a little foamy poof pad. I don't know what the name of those things are. And then it comes packaged really cute. That's what that looks like. So I'm going to go through what I what I got here. Just um, I picked like random things that I'd been wanting to try anyway. So this first little thing here, and it's good that they label it for you. It's got little like sticky glue on it, so I'm gonna throw that in there. The first thing is the NARS Pro Pro Prime Eyeshadow Base. I've heard great things about this, and I have never tried it. So they give you a little tube of it. It's about half full, definitely enough for a few uses. Um, I just realized how awful my nails look. This one's like broken and chipping. Um, so that is what one of these little doe foot applicators would be for. And then the other one that's in a little tube like that is the Benefit Oola Lift Concealer. And this already has a, a tube in it, which is pretty cool. I mean, uh, it has a little doe foot applicator in it. So I wouldn't need that for this one. I wouldn't need the other doe foot applicator for this one is what I'm saying. And this stuff I've wanted to try for a while too. It intrigued me because there's only one color of it and it's like a pink. That's what it looks like right here. So it's kind of like an under eye brightening concealer I guess. I don't know. It doesn't look, it doesn't have a smell or anything but I'll have to try it on my eyes and my under eyes and see. I guess it's just supposed to be brightening. It doesn't really, that's why it's one color, I guess, because it doesn't really show up much on your skin. Um, what's this? This is a blush, Burberry, I got hiccups now, Burberry Lip and Cheek Bloom in Burberry Rose was the color that I picked. So they give you like a, Kind of like a mushy 
spongy consistency. I think it was a cream blush. I don't even remember now, but it's pressed into like a little pan. That's what that looks like. So let's do a swatch of this and see. Hmm. Those Burberry things are expensive and it's not like pigmented at all. So I guess I'm glad that I tried it and didn't go and buy one. It's like it's not showing up on my skin at all. <laughs> well, that's what that looks like. Um, then what's this? Uh, the Guerlain Meteorite Pearls. I did pick a sample of this because this is something I've always wanted to try. Um, oh, they smell really good. But there's like a weird... Whoa, whoa, whoa. See, I guess this is the downside of getting samples of stuff that's meant to be bigger. So I got a bunch of the little crushed pearls in here. And then like a little pad thing. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like watermelon or something. Now I guess you can kind of see that Burberry blush. I don't know. It made my hand matte where I put that. But there's not really a lot of color to it. So maybe it's just the shade I picked, but... Yeah, the Meteorite Pearls are super sparkly, super powdery, but I think that's because they're crushed in here. Look, that's really pretty. <laughs> I don't want it to force me to buy the full-size product because it's expensive just for, like, one highlighter thing, but that's really pretty. And, um, I will put... Like I said, I'm going to put their information below. When you buy a box, I believe it's 20 is it 20 or 25 dollars a box? I will put a little annotation because I can't remember. But um, the samples are all the little sample sizes are five dollars a piece, um, and you get five in a box. So yeah, twenty. The, I want to make sure I say this correctly. I should have made little notes, but for every five dollars you spend. You can put that towards the, the full size of a, a full size product, but it expires from month to month, so like you have to use it if you're going to use it. Um, and then the last thing I got here is what's pressed in this little eyeshadow pan. It's the the Clay de Po. I'm probably butchering that name. Satin eye color, and the color was 107. I think it had a name to it, but I cannot remember what it was. It comes in a little clamshell case that I'm having an issue opening here. But at least everything is like safely packaged so it didn't get destroyed in the mail. And there's also a little clear sticker over the top of it here. Alright, let's get that out of there. So it's cool that they don't just like give you a little bit of crumbled eyeshadow, they actually press it in a pan for you. That's what that looks like. And it will go right in my little magnetic palette here. Not palette, but compact. So that it'll be safe in my makeup drawer. And let's take a little swatch of this. Ooh, this is a really... Almost feels like a cream shadow, but it's not. pretty color. They had a lot of different colors, but I picked the purple, the lilac color. <laughs> Alright, where can I swatch this? Oh yeah, that's really pretty. It's like a shimmery, shimmery lilac. I didn't want to swatch it on the top of my hand because I have the, the shimmer from the meteorites on there. Okay, so all in all, I would say this is a cute idea if you want to, if you're thinking of buying a, like a super high-end expensive product and you're not sure if you're gonna like it or not and you don't want to spend all that money if you're not gonna like it this is a fun way to try it out you can you don't have to get a full box like this you can just buy a five dollar sample product I cannot talk I'm all jumbled today I will put all their information below in the description box so that you can go check their website out and Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. This is fun to try new stuff, and especially stuff that I probably wouldn't have 
bought <laughs> the full size of. Um, like the the meteorites, I've wanted those forever for ages and I just couldn't bring myself to buy it but I hope you guys enjoyed and I will talk to you in my next video.